What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Samsung has already started rolling out the One UI 6.0 stable version in many countries on the S23 series. This is the Galaxy S23 Ultra and I am residing in India. So here we have already started getting this update. As you can see, the version number ends with BWJM and uh, the size is about 358.39 MB. Since I've been on the beta version of One UI 6.0, this is the kind of update I'm going to receive. And if you have been testing the beta, you will also get a similar OTA update all you need to do is just install it you will be on the stable version but if you are installing one UI 6.0 for the first time then you will see a different change log you'll be getting a huge size probably more than about 2.5 to 3 GB of size you will get and the change log is going to talk about all the brand new features about which I have already posted a video yesterday that's a very very detailed video about all the brand new features we have got all the major and minor features I have covered so I will leave a link for that video in the description if you have missed that I would suggest you to go ahead and check that video out i have discussed about more than 30 new features in that particular video so go ahead and check that video out the link is in the description now coming back to this update on the galaxy s23 ultra here you can see in the change log it says hello this is one ui beta operation team we are very grateful to all of you for your positive and active participation in one ui beta program after completion of beta program we are not going to release any new beta software version we are no longer going to provide any official reply to your opinion beta feedback usage will be stopped so no more feedbacks no more beta releases this is the full and final version of one ui 6.0 on the s23 series if you scroll down a bit you can see it says beta users must update to the official version there is no continuous update of the future official version to the personnel who continue to use beta binaries after beta close so if you're on beta make sure you update your phone with the stable version release now if you look at the security patch it is still the october 2023 patch i was expecting the november patch as the Z Fold 5 have already received the November patch along with One UI 6.0 Beta 4 release. But here on the S23 series, I am still seeing the October security patch. You let me know whether you have received the uh, November security patch or not. Drop a comment. Uh, if not now, probably in the next couple of weeks, I will be able to get that update. I'll keep you guys posted about that. Now I have already installed this update and the phone is running very, very smooth. The animations have improved a lot with the situation of One UI 6.0. You can see the app opening and closing animation is just perfect. The lock screen animation is pretty cool. This is certainly the best of the animations and transition effects we have received, at least until now. And as far as the battery life is concerned, even on the beta, the phone has been doing very good. Now what I'm going to do is, I will test the battery life on this phone. I will use the phone for a couple of more days and then let you know guys about the battery performance. Has it improved? Has it gone bad? I will keep you guys posted. I will post the screen on time on the Galaxy S23 Ultra. So stay tuned for that video. Now in this video, I'm not going to discuss about any new features because uh, yesterday's detailed video talks about every everything you need so I suggest you again to check that video out the link is in the description but before you go there be sure to subscribe to the channel and become a part of Apex community to know your Samsung Galaxy phone better and give this video a like if you find this video informational thanks for watching my name is Salian signing off cheers bye bye